Final Fantasy Type-0 HD launched last Tuesday in the United States. The game goes in a different direction than the regular Final Fantasy games. What we have here is honestly a great game. While playing the game, you'll realize that you can choose from 14 characters to play as. And that's why today, I'm going to tell you my top 5 favorite playable characters in Final Fantasy Type-0 HD. Uh, just a note that this list is primarily based off how the character plays, not how they act. But anyways, let's get started. Starting us off at number 5 is Trey. Trey is what you can say the marksman of this game. Trey has the longest range of any of the other playable characters. Meanwhile, he still does large amounts of damage. Even if you were about to get hit by an enemy, he is honestly quite fast and you shouldn't have any problem dodging the attack. Trey is the best way to play it safe when in a battle. Moving on to number 4 is Queen. Queen is your average swordsman, uh, swordswoman actually, and honestly, people may see that as boring. What is really so special about her? Well, this girl packs quite the punch. She is super fast and her attacks are deadly. Even her lightning is insane. Also, I made her defense through the roof in my game, which makes her a beast. Queen should have no problem completely obliterating any enemy. And number 3 is Ace. Now I feel kind of bad putting the quote unquote main character on this list, but hear me out. The main reason I put Ace on this list is because his attacks are so unique. You literally attack with cards. There are so many options that you can choose from with these cards. Some cards will attack, some will defend, and there are just so many of them. Also Ace's dodging is really superb for he turns invisible for the second when he does it. But all in all, with Ace's huge variety of cards, he can fit the playstyle of any gamer who decides to pick up this game. And at number 2 is Seven. This character fights with finesse. Every one of her movements just seem graceful. Even though she literally is a beast when it comes to attacking, her standard attack is powerful on its own. She also can use Snake Bite, which acts like a hook shot from The Legend of Zelda. You can use the Elemental Lash, which sends a devastating blow using any one of the three magic types. Seven is really a force to be reckoned with. Finally, and number one is... Cater. Now I feel that a lot of you may be surprised by this, but I really just love how Cater plays. She honestly isn't that special. I used Cater all the way back at the PAX East demo and I just really enjoyed playing with her. Cater can attack pretty much anywhere, up close, mid range, or sometimes even at long range, even though I primarily use her at mid range. Her main attack, which is when she shoots her Magistite or Magikite blasters, however you want to say that, is honestly uh, quite a powerful attack. It's not as strong as one of Queen's slashes, but since the attack rate of Cater is quite high, it adds up over time. You can also shoot all three elements, which is an added plus. So yeah, Cater, I love ya. Well, that wraps things up. I hope you all enjoyed. Let me know what your favorite characters are to play as in the comments below. By the way, if you're skeptical about picking up Type-0, just please do it. I'm having so much fun in the game and I don't regret buying it a single bit. Final Fantasy Type-0 is honestly just really one fun hell of a game.